So here we have the two speaker, the PK112A, the active system, and the PK112 speaker, the passive speaker. So I'll be testing these two. So make sure you check out the comparison, the audio of these two speakers. And by the end of the video, I will be sharing my thought on these two speakers. Dream along with me. Listen to the whispers sing. Listen to the singers shout. Come into my solitude. Be my big mouth. Thoughts unspoken, thoughts unsaid. Lies of hearth and home. Children broken on the bed and left to lie alone. Things you talk around, scum you choke on down. Come into my solitude, step on sacred ground. We were speaking of values and violence, breaking silence. Though I weary be, come into my tenderness, dream along with me. Listen to the whispers sing, listen to the singers shout, come into my solitude, be my big mouth. Thoughts unspoken, thoughts unsaid. Lies of hearth and home, children broken on the bed and left to lie alone. Things you talk around, scum you choke on down. Come into my solitude, step on sacred ground. We were speaking of values and Breaking
So you have been listening to both the speakers and to me, it sounds almost the same to me. So I cannot differentiate any difference between this and this. So basically, it's identical. The difference is one is built-in amplifier and one without amplifier. So overall, the sound uh, for slow music, um, I'm pleasantly surprised. I'm, I like the sound, but if I push harder with, I mean, a higher tempo song, I mean, rock song or disco song or more demanding song, I think that uh, becomes too much for them because there's a limitation for this kind of pricing speakers. So what I feel that these speakers tend to have brighter sound and then there's no, there's less warmness in it, but they do have bass, although it's not that uh, a lot of bass there, but they do have it. So overall for male vocal, I feel that it lacks the warm sound that I personally uh, like it. But overall in a small installation, let's say for a school or a classroom or a small room, small cafe, it's okay uh, for background music or some speeches. Yeah, it should be a very good uh, speakers for this kind of pricing. So one downside that I found that the active system doesn't come with a balanced line input. So what we have here is just a RCA which is an unbalanced signal in line input. So the rest, these two XLR is my input. So this we cannot use for a bigger installation. Let's say we need a cabling from one side to another side, a longer cabling. We are not able to do it because it's just an RCA. So that is the real limitation of the speakers. And then there's a speaker output here, which actually I can send the audio signal to the passive system and the amplifier able to power up both this unit and this unit so confirm it can power this both and it is much louder so this also can help us to save more money because i doesn't need to buy two units of the active i can buy one active and one passive i mean for a classroom this is a very good idea on saving costs and portability. So here is my thought and hopefully it can help you all and I will see you in the next video and see you and bye bye.